Doesn't it seem like everybody is getting rich on the internet except you? Like, every idea they come up with works, but everything you try just doesn't. I'm a failure. That's because they understand the secret to differentiation, and you don't. Yet. In this video, I'm going to walk you through a framework that has the power to turn just about any idea, no matter how small, into a product or service that will immediately grab people's attention. Because all those entrepreneurs you see online, creators, influencers, they aren't any smarter than you. They're just using this simple strategy to separate themselves from any and all competition, which is why it seems like the internet loves them more than it loves you. The secret to differentiating yourself on the internet is to solve one specific specific problem for one specific person in one specific way. It's called the 111 framework. Last year, I paid $68,000 to join a mastermind with some of the biggest creators in the world, and they all in some way or another, used this simple 111 framework I'm about to share with you to build their seven and eight figure businesses. So you can either join some fancy schmancy mastermind like I did and pay $68,000, or you can sit back while I give you the secret to differentiation. And at the end, I'm gonna give you a bonus framework to help you charge the most money possible for your product or service without making the customer upset. But first, let's start with the problem. Most people think the key to getting customers or even going viral is to appeal to the widest number of people possible. Translation, I solve lots of different types of problems. But let me tell you a little story that shows how, as a customer, this isn't actually what you want. Let's say you have a stained glass window above your garage, and one day, your neighbor's idiot teenager accidentally throws a rock through it. So, you go on TaskRabbit to find someone to help you fix it. And what you find are hundreds and hundreds of people who all call themselves window repair specialists, and they all have five-star reviews, and they all have tons of testimonials. But this isn't any old window, right? This is a stained glass window. And you want to make sure that you hire the right person for the job. So after a lot of scrolling, you eventually find one person who doesn't have that many reviews and doesn't have a ton of testimonials, but in their bio, they call themselves a stained glass window repair specialist. So out of the hundreds and hundreds of task rabbits, which person are you gonna call? Are you gonna call the generalist who says they can do anything for anyone? Or are you gonna call the specialist who says all I do all day long is solve the exact problem that you have. You're going to call the specialist every single time. Now, you might be sitting there going, Cole, if I say I only solve one specific problem, that's going to cut out 99% of people. And you're right. That's a good thing. Because when you try to be something for everyone, you end up being something for no one. So the secret to differentiation is you can't say you solve every problem. You have to say you solve one specific problem. The next question is for who? For everyone who has that problem? No, for one specific person who has that problem. So watch what happens when we keep the problem the same, but we swap out different target audiences. So stained glass window repair for royal families, stained glass window repair for antique dealers, stained glass window repair for churches. Same problem, but three completely different target buyers. And again, you might be saying, Cole, but if I say I only work with one specific type of person, that's going to cut out 99% of people. Yes, it will. And that's a good thing because each one of these buyers has a completely different set of sub problems, wants, needs, and expectations. Do you really think having the royal family as a client is going to be the same as having a church as a client? No, of course not. Which means if all you do is work with one type of person, you're going to know how to help that type of person better than anyone else, which differentiates you even more. But the real magic happens when you solve one specific problem for one specific person in one specific way. And coming up with a different way to help people is always the hardest part because every industry has solutions that are already popular, right? So struggling to lose weight, you hire a personal trainer or a nutritionist. Struggling to sell your house, you hire a real estate agent. These are already the popular solutions to these problems. Your your job and the secret to differentiating yourself and any product or service is to come up with a different way to solve that one specific problem for one specific person. Because if the way you help these people is different than what everyone else provides, 
guess what? You officially have zero competition. Now, I know the 111 framework works because this is how we built our beginner writing program, Ship 30 for 30, to millions of dollars in revenue. We solved one specific problem. People can't write on a consistent basis. For one specific type of person, someone who wants to start writing on the internet, not all the people who have already been writing on the internet for a decade, in one specific way, creating a 30-day writing challenge that holds them accountable to a daily writing habit. It's so simple, but this is how Ship 30 became the fastest growing writing program on the internet. And you might be thinking, okay, well, Cole, sure, that worked for you, but can this really work for people like me? Yes, it absolutely can. And I also know because I've coached hundreds of ghostwriters in our premium ghostwriting academy on how to implement this 111 framework, differentiate themselves, and start pitching high-ticket clients with a new and unique service. And we now have people in our ghostwriting program doing anywhere from five grand a month as a side hustle to 50 grand a month running a small one-person agency. So yes, this 111 framework can work for any product or any service. And here's the big takeaway. But before I give you the bonus framework, I promise you, and if you find yourself jotting down notes and enjoying this video, do me a favor and hit subscribe. I publish videos like this every week. Now, the last framework I wanna share with you is this simple equation. Revenue equals domain expertise divided by supply. Translation, how much you can charge is purely a function of what you know, domain expertise, and how many other people in the world have that same knowledge, supply. Which means the single easiest way to move yourself into premium pricing territory is to get so specific about what problem you solve, for who, and how that the combination of those three variables means you have zero competition. You're the winner. And when you're the winner, you set the price. And the faster you can make these three things clear in your bio, on your website, in your cold outreach, the more likely you will be to succeed on the internet. Remember, the internet wants to make you rich. Social algorithms are literally engineered to help you reach the right customers and for the right customers to be able to discover you. All you have to do is tell the internet what makes you different and the algorithm takes care of the rest. So use the 111 framework, drop any questions you have on how to use this framework in the comments, and I'll see you in the next video.